So in this problem, we're told to evaluate the integral from 0 to power 4 of 7 plus 9 times the cosine squared of theta over the cosine squared of theta, d theta. So let's just start off by rewriting our integral. So 0 to pi over 4, 7 plus 9 times the cosine squared of theta over the cosine squared of theta. So in order to solve this problem, what we're going to do is split this first part into two fractions. So what I'm going to rewrite it as is 7 over the cosine squared of theta plus 9 times the cosine squared of theta over the cosine squared of theta. And so this is going to allow us to solve it, right? So you see this, these are going to cancel right here. So 9 times the cosine squared of theta over the cosine squared of theta will cancel. So this is going to become plus 9. What about this part right here? Well, this is the same thing as 7 times 1 over the cosine squared of theta. And we know that um, the inverse of cosine squared of theta is just going to be the inverse of it. So the inverse of cosine is secant, so it's going to be secant squared of theta. So it's basically 7 times the secant squared of theta is what this is going to become, and then plus 9. So basically this whole thing up here is going to be equal to 7 plus the secant squared of theta plus 9. So let me erase what we've got here, and then we'll actually solve it. So it's going to be the integral 0 to power over 4 of 7 times the secant squared of theta plus 9 e theta. So what we want to do is find the antiderivative of the function on the inside, and then evaluate it at power over 4 and 0. So what, we know that the derivative of tangent of theta is going to be secant squared of theta. So if that's the case, then the antiderivative of secant squared of theta is the tangent of theta. So it's going to be 7 times the tangent of theta. And then the antiderivative of a constant is just the constant times your variable, so theta. And so what we want to do is evaluate it at power over 4 and 0. So First we'll plug in power over 4, so 7 times the tangent of power over 4 plus 9. So the tangent of power over 4 is the sine of power over 4 over the cosine of power over 4. And at this value they're both the same, right? So it's rad 2 over 2 over rad 2 over 2. And so if we have the same thing over the same thing, it's just 1. So basically the tangent of power over 4 is just 1. And then, so 7 times 1 is just 7 plus, and then we got to evaluate, uh, so this is 9 times the power of 4. So 9 times power of 4 is just 9 power of 4. So we have 7 plus 9 power of 4. Write that right here, 7 plus 9 power of 4. And then we minus whatever the value 0 plugged in is. So the tangent of 0 is the sine of 0 over the cosine of 0. So the sine of 0 is equal to 0 and then the cosine of 0 is equal to 1 so it's just 0 times 7 right and we multiply by 7 so 7 times 0 plus 9 and then we plug in 0 is just going to be 0. So basically we're not subtracting anything we're subtracting 0 but that's not anything so we get 7 plus 9 pi over 4 and so that's going to be the answer. So our final answer is 7 plus 9 pi over 4.